Be very, very quiet. There are crying babies about. Hey everyone, this is Robbie's Blog, and welcome to another in theater movie review series. So, today's movie that I'll be reviewing today is Netflix's Belgium film, Noise. And before I get into my thoughts about this movie, here are a few words from the channel. Alright everybody, it's time to get on the social media train. Want to chat with me in 100 words or less? Then check out my Twitter account. Want to talk about movies, TV shows, and video games within the group? Then check out my Facebook account. Want to check out some of my ultra cool fan art? Then check out my DeviantArt page. Want to get the lowdown on everything that's happening on this channel? Then check all of the above. And now, we return to our regularly scheduled program. So the film starts off with a young man named Matt who is an influencer. And he ends up moving into his own family home along with his wife Liv and their newborn son Julius. And everything seems to be going fine for Matt until he discovers a dark secret about his father's company. And so Matt spends the rest of the film trying to find out the dark secret of his father's company while having to deal with his newborn son Julius crying. So what are my thoughts about this film? I thought it was pretty decent. So let's talk about what I did like about this film. So the main thing I liked about this film was the tension. This film has a lot of good tension throughout as we get to see how Matt is slowly going insane throughout the film as he tries to discover the dark secrets about his father's company but at the same time he starts neglecting his duties as a husband and as a father as he lets this whole dark secret around his father's company actually consume him. And there's also a lot of intense moments dealing with Matt being afraid of sounds and we get to see from his perspective how these sounds are terrifying to him. And I really like the way that the movie was able to convey just how terrifying all these sounds are to Matt and it makes the movie even more creepy to watch. Now here are some issues that I do have with this film. The first issue that I have with this film was the pacing. I felt like the pacing throughout this movie was very slow and it took a while for the film to get to the more intense parts and I was like sitting at the edge of my seat trying to figure out okay when is this intense part coming and when is it going to get to the part about Matt trying to solve the dark secrets that's surrounding his father's company and stuff like that and yeah it did take a while for the film to get to those intense scenes another issue that I have with this film was that the plot was a bit confusing to me like there was a lot of things in this plot that I didn't really understand or a lot of things in this plot that wasn't fully explained to me like for example regarding about how Matt seems to be terrified of noises in general especially with his son's crying I was wondering to myself about did Matt have a phobia against noises Oh, did he just became terrified of noises once he moved into the house and started stressing out about everything going on with his life. The film wasn't really clear about any of that and they didn't really explain about whether or not Matt has a phobia of noise or he was just stressed out about trying to find out what was going on with his father's company and trying to be a father at the same time. So the film was very vague about all that and I wish that the film actually explored a bit more with these characters and explained about their situations a bit better so I wouldn't have to get so confused about the plot itself. Before I give up my overall thoughts on this film, I would like to let you guys know that there are affiliate links in the description box below if you are interested in buying any of the movies mentioned or linked in this video. If you do buy any of the movies mentioned in this video using the affiliate links in the description box below, I will receive a small commission which will help out with this channel. So please feel free to use the affiliate links in the description box below if you are interested in adding any of these movies to your movie collection. Overall, I give noise. i watch it. Even though the plot was very confusing and the pacing was a bit slow at times, I did like the fact that this movie was very intense from beginning to end and I really liked the intense moments with Matt trying to deal with having a newborn son and trying to deal with his son's constant crying and also developing a fear for noise in general and then him trying to find out what's going on with his father's company and what kind of dark secrets his family has. So I did enjoy those intense moments as well as the mystery aspect of this film. So if you're looking for a thriller film that deals with noise, then you should definitely check out Noise. 
So those are my thoughts on noise and tell me in the comments down below. Have you seen noise? And if you have, did you like the movie? Did you hate the movie? And what's your favorite horror film that dealt with noises? Please let me know in the comments down below. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is Robbie's blog and I'll see you guys later. Hey guys, like this video? If you want to check out more crazy content from this channel, then please hit that big old colorful subscribe button. And if you are feeling extra generous, then please support me through Patreon so I can make more awesome content for this channel.